Relation and function. Relation is defined as the relationship between two values. And a function is also a relation wherein in every input, there is only one output. And those input and output are the domain and the range in our xy plane, wherein the domain is the set of uh, x values and the x values go from left to right. So the domain is how far left and right it goes. While the range is the set of all y values and the y values goes up and down. So range is how far up and down it goes. Okay, so let us take this given example. Let's identify if, is it a function? So if we're going to examine our given points here, if x is 1, y is 0. If x is 0, y is 5. If x is 3, y is negative 4. If x is 5, y is 0. Notice that in every input or x values, there is a unique output, which is the y values. Therefore, it is a function. And where are the domains? The domains are the set of x values. So it's 1, 0, 3, and 5. So let us arrange them in ascending order for it to be organized. And for our range, it is the set of all y values, the 0, 5, negative 4, and 0. So we can just write this uh, 2, 0, 1. So it's negative 4, 0, and 5. And for our given number 2, is this a function? So to examine the uh, set of points, in point 1, in first point and second point, notice that if our x is 2, y is negative 2. But the same x, it gives us a different value of y. So from these two points, this tells us that the set of points is not a function. So our domain, the x values 2, 0, 2, and 3. For our range, negative 2, positive 2, positive 1, and negative 1. Uh, in mapping diagrams, we can see uh, the in a different perspective on how we identify if a given set of points is a function or not. So uh, same given number 1 since the domain are 0, 1, 3, 5 and the range are negative 4, uh, 0, and 5. So if our uh, x is 0, our y is 5. If x is 1, y is 0. If x is 3, y is negative 4. If x is 5, y is 0. So notice that uh, they have a unique values for uh, for every uh, x. There's a unique values of y. While in given number 2, we're in the domain is 0, 2, 3, and the range is negative 2, negative 1, 1, 2. So if x is 0, y is 2. If x is 2, y is negative 2. But the same x, which is 2, it gives us a different uh, value, which is 1. If x is 3, y is negative 1. So in this uh, given here, wherein it gives us two uh, different values of output in one input, so this tells us that it is not really a function. Now, if, uh, if the given is a graph, so we can use this vertical line test to check if it is a function or not. If the line or the graph or the points will touch our vertical line test once, therefore it is a function. Okay, look at this given uh, on my left. So this line touches, I mean the graph touches our red line, the vertical line test, once. Point D touches this line once, the point C, the point B, the point E, uh, point A. Okay, so therefore, uh, this graph is a function. While in the other side, we have no problem here so far. Point E touches the line once, point A, point B, but our problem is in here. The point C, point F, and point G touches our vertical line at once. Therefore, this set of points here is not a function.